Okay, to download the, the native game for for the funky uh, OS that working on RG Nano, uh, this link do not work. Okay, so just the FYI. Just when I click on it, you give me this. So don't close it. Just go back. Okay. I guess you could try it several times, but it doesn't work. All right. And I already downloaded those already. Uh, so click on this crafting. Sometimes it doesn't download right away, so you have to look for it. You're looking for O O P K. That's the file that you want to download. So I download it into a native game folder. Now I create a I create a hard drive, but you could just go directly to uh directly to the funky. And then go to the native native game folder, and then save it. This one I download from uh, something, but I don't think those work. So I'm redoing it. I just put it on my hard drive, create a folder called Funky, and then I put an SD card, and I copy the SD card over, which doesn't have anything in here. Okay, doesn't have nothing. So you just have to build it as you go. So you go here and just click save so that's another game and that's how you do it you just click back and if i believe already download this one already so i'm going to go to do uh, uh, luke what do you call that duke, uh, duke do link or whatever how you pronounce it they just go all the way down give you some information then you want to download the opk opk is a game that one run on it normally run on the g g menu uh, but they created a link so you could actually see it so you don't have to you don't have to change the menu you can stay in here without going to the g menu because most of this game originally run from g menu but uh, funky uh, uh, OS created the link so you could just uh, download it uh, so I'm here now so that's how you do it just download one at a time this one will automatically give you the download so you just click download and then save all right so that's how you do it just FYI in case you you want to this is how I do this one now the other one that I gave you the link is the same thing you just click on it okay and then save it to the for example you click on it and you will you will want it to go to the one called the lipo lipo uh it's a library retro that's what it stands for okay and then you're going to go to court and then you just click save i only have a copy already so if you want to replace it just play yes Okay, so that's how you download for for this one right here for the for the court. So when you open it up, it's gonna ask you when you click on it, it's gonna ask you which where's your game folder. So you just point your game folder to to the same folder. Uh, you just point to example when you open up the the court how you play it. You just you say okay if you start something called Game Boy. Uh, for example, Game Boy or Super Nintendo, if you open this one, it's going to say, where's your Super Nintendo? And you just go to the Super Nintendo folder, and they say, here's my game. Okay? And then, and then choose the game, and then you, you can play it. So the best one to, to use would be the one that you don't have. Like, for example, you don't have uh, Neo Geo Pocket. Okay, yeah, you do have Neo Geo Pocket. So just choose the one that you don't have, like one... Uh, the MSN or Saturn. I think this one already have. Uh, do I have Saturn here already? Sega, Sega Master. No, I don't have Saturn. So you could put Saturn in here and play it. Okay. Or uh, only have Turbo 60. I only have one game that I don't think it works. So I'm going to test it on this machine, see if it works. And the way CD is, you have to search for CD. And the CD format is going to be uh, BIN and CUE. Okay, and I also put this in because it's a CD uh, key in order to run it. I put that in here. Normally, you don't put it here. You just put it, you know, outside here. 
think I need to, I probably need to put that one outside as well, just in case. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna drop it down here. So I have another copy. Uh, that's for the CD game. So the Nano RG Nano original frame uh, star frame will do not support CD. So this one does support CD. So you could use that as well. And that will be so you just have to get familiar. This is Mega Drive. Sometimes this is PlayStation. And I think Pico, Pico Funky Arc. This is, uh, I think, Mega Drive. I think this is the one, might be the PC Engine. Uh, but yeah, and then NES, uh, that one is pretty obvious. I forgot, but I don't know how to pronounce it. And some of the Commodore 64 or something is all in here. So you just download one by one. All right, that's pretty much it. Hopefully that helped this video. All right, later.